Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be on this Revolution Ultimate Nudes palette. Now this is the light version. So this is a nine pan palette that looks very similar to the Huda Nude palettes. So yeah, we're going to do a tutorial, swatches and review on this today. So you get nine shades, five of them are matte and then you get four metallics. I've tried like some of the Revolution's nine pan palettes before and they can be very hit and miss. So I'm not really sure what to expect from this one it's six pounds i got it from revolution's website but i've seen them at superdrug and um, i think they're at ulta and a couple of other places as well like asos so i'm going to start with a crease color and quite a few of these are all kind of like the same um depth so like this one this one and this one um you know you couldn't build any of them up to get like a really deep color so i'm only going to go in with this one and then i'm going to put that in the crease the dusty shade on i was expecting it to be more like the pan but on my eyes i feel like it looks more peachy and i feel like it it would look like what i would expect this one to look like but anyway i'm gonna go into the darkest shade now i'm gonna put that on the outer corner and through the crease i would have liked more of a medium kind of shade to build it up with but this is kind of all we have so we're just gonna work with it Okay, so that's that deepest brown shade in the palette. Um, I wish it was a little darker. I feel like it's gone on like the other shade. I feel like it's gone on a little bit lighter on the eyes. But you know, we're still going to work with it. So I'm going to put one of these purples on my eyes now. Um, they're all really pretty. So like you've got this one, this one and this one. This is more of like a satin or like a less metallic -y than the other three shades. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into this shade and then I'll use this one slightly on the inner corner a little bit I wanted to use this shade because I don't know if you can see the texture on this one looks a little bit different so I'm hoping this one will be more um, shimmery and metallic and then this one I can just put on the inner corner Okay, so I've just put that shade on my eyes and it looks really pretty and really metallic but it was a bit hard to pick up with my brush and um, I tried to like wetting my brush I think it'd probably be best to go in with your fingers I've got like fake nails on at the moment and um, these are just kiss nails I'm not breaking lockdown to get my nails done and um, so yeah I've, I, I can't get like in my, my inner corner like to put it on with so I just struggled on with the brush um, and then I tried putting this shade on like an inner corner and it looks like really silly so I'm actually going to nip into another palette and we'll use something from there because this shade is just it won't do anything for me in a corner I need something a little bit more metallic so I'm gonna nip into this is the I Heart Revolution Unicorn Heart Palette so this has just come out as well this was £10 so this is like an all shimmer palette which is a bit different from them like even like these darker shades you don't think they're metallic but they are so this is like the first time using this as well so this is like a first impressions so i'm going to use this shade here as my inner corner actually applied really nicely that is actually the shade unicorn as well in the unicorn palette which is funny and I like it it went on really nicely and it has like a slight pink undertone so it goes with like the warm tones of this eye like 
look really well and um, I was hoping that this palette would pull like a more slightly purple look but we're just you know it's it's more of a like a nude kind of warm look once it's on the eyes I think if I was to really pull it purple I probably would have needed to have used this one Okay, so we're on to the lower lash line now, and honestly, there's because there's not that many shades in here, we don't have like that much um, choice of what, like, what to use, and these two look almost identical. I'm just going to use this shade here and put that under my eye. I've done my lashes and liner and I'm just wearing a little half lash and um, just because I find them so much easier to apply so yeah it's a not bad little palette this one um the metallics need a little bit of work like once if you can get this one to work with like any particular brush or use your fingers it is really pretty on the eyes and I did need to pick pop into another palette just to do that in a corner but yeah I, I think it's all right and I still need to try this one out I've tried almost every color uh, actually I haven't tried almost every color I've tried half the colors I've tried like five in here I thought I'd tried more than I had for some reason but everything I've tried has been all right everything's blended out all right it's a nice little palette and there's somebody always in my videos that will say in the comments what lip are you wearing this is my go-to lip combo at the moment so I'm wearing the Colourpop lip liner in BFF and then I'm going over with this gloss by Kitty Lux Cosmetics in the nude shade and that is my makeup company and um, I'm not in production yet I'm just in kind of like testing and trial stages but I'll leave my links in the description box and you can check out like I post like updates on how I'm doing on like TikTok and Instagram Instagram so you can see what kind of products that I'm coming out with. Okay yeah so not a little bad little palette from Revolution. I know that you can always pick these up on some kind of special offer. Revolution does three for two a lot or they do discounts and Superdrug also do the same. They're also always doing like three for two or occasionally they'll do buy one get one three. So I think it's a good idea to pick them up um, in one of those kind of offers. You can save yourself some money. And then I like the one shade that I used from this palette. I'm not sure whether I should do some kind of video on this because it's an all shade my palette but if you would like to see that let me know and you know if people are interested I'll do that so I'm gonna leave you with some swatches of this palette now and I will see you again shortly bye